right, welcome back. Today I'll be uh, distilling nitric acid from sodium bisulfate and uh, ammonium nitrate. Thought it'd be a nice follow-up. Sodium bisulfate is sold as a pool chemical. It's a pH minus. So it's set up for a simple distillation. Um, basically, it just requires a lot of heat. The usual way of doing this is with potassium nitrate or sodium nitrate and bisulfate, also known as the dry method. Um, I haven't done this before with ammonium nitrate. It tends to decompose, so we'll see how it goes. Uh, I used a like a cheap um, standard hot plate. Uh, these things are rated, I think, three and a half thousand watts. It's just uh, raw power, since I don't need any steering. And on the left, you can see the collector. And I will use a tube that goes outside. So I don't breathe in any of the fumes produced, because they're quite toxic. Let's see how it goes. Also, I should mention that the easier way of doing this is, this is with uh, sulfuric acid, but um, it's been uh, getting harder to obtain, in Europe at least, since the new regulations regarding sulfuric acid. So the bisulfate method might be more available to uh, amateur chemists. You might want to do this with an old flask or Erlenmeyer in this case, um, because dry distillation is uh, one, one sure way of breaking your glass. As soon as it um, it hardens again, it tends to um, it tends to crack because of the expansion. Not a yellow color, it's nitrogen dioxide. I'm gonna dial it down a bit because I don't want it to destroy uh, too much of the ammonium nitrate. Also, I greased the joints with some uh, sulfuric acid. Um, I do have vacuum grease, but the nitric acid uh, tends to uh, just destroy it. So. As you can see, we're collecting uh, nitric acid. It's uh, Slight discoloration. It's probably some water vapor as well, since the starting materials weren't perfectly dry. The evolution is starting to slow down. I'm gonna turn down the heat. All right, so it's time to weigh the product, and I uh, just wanted to show you my uh, my new pump. I recently bought this uh, tiny little pump. It can be bought online for a couple bucks. It's very suitable for uh, small scale distillations, such as this one. The yield is around 3.9 grams, and I'll have to calculate how much that is. Uh, theoretical, um, my starting material was about 10 grams of ammonium nitrate and 15 grams of sodium bisulfate, both probably still a bit wet. And of course, the uh, concentration. Since I uh, lost my analytical balance a couple years ago in a move, sadly, I will have to. Uh, to test the, the concentration instead of weighing it because it's much easier but uh, the scale just isn't uh, accurate enough to do it and just to show it that show you that I'm not bullshitting around I have standard copper test which all the cool kids do
I believe very concentrated nitric acid reacts slower with copper, so that look good to go. Alright, so it's uh, quite viable to make uh, nitric acid from ammonium nitrate and sodium bisulfate, uh, which are both cheap if available. And if you have any questions, just uh, let me know below. Thanks for watching.